I thank Representative Black, Madam Speaker, I rise today in strong support of H.J. Resolution 43. This resolution will overturn an Obama administration rule that forces states to direct federal funds to abortion providers like Planned Parenthood. States receive federal funding to support family planning services. They have discretion to distribute these Title X funds in the way that best serves their communities. Many states have exercised their discretion to direct Title X funding to community health centers, family health clinics that do not provide abortions and withhold funding from abortion providers like Planned Parenthood. It's just common sense that states know the needs of their people and their communities better than Washington bureaucrats do. The states should be able to decide how these federal funds are distributed. Unfortunately, the Obama administration disagreed. So they issued a last-minute regulation in their final days in office that would force states to distribute funding to abortion providers. Their rule would take away states' abilities to direct Title X funds to providers that offer comprehensive care but do not participate in abortions. It would, and it would force states to enable the flow of funds to Planned Parenthood and others in the abortion industry. I think this is reprehensible. Now Congress has the opportunity to right this wrong and undo the massive overreach. We're taking action to protect taxpayers and defend life by using the Congressional Review Act to overturn this rule. Overturning the rule won't reduce funding for women's health care. In fact, it'll let states direct these funds in the best way that's best for their citizens. It will ensure states can support women's health as well as protect the unborn. Madam Speaker, this resolution is essential to rolling back executive overreach and standing up for the sanctity of life. I urge my colleagues to join me in supporting H.J. Resolution 43. Thank you, and I yield back the balance of my time.